Hey, what is up everybody, Blaze for here and today I bring you guys another video of Black Clover Mobile. Inside today's video, guys, you already see the title, you see the sneaky thumbnail. We are showcasing our man, Julius here, who we managed to get the 60K, but that's not all did we manage to do with this character, but we ended up maxing out his stinking card. So I finally got the card maxed out in which, long story short, I had some crazy good luck. We had seven multis left on the second ro rotation that we were end up doing. And if you guys want to check it right here, let's just start from here up. It went absolutely insane. We had so many actual multis that were double SSR multis here for our last seven. And I have to say, my friend Scythe and me were both in a call and it was ballistic how crazy our luck was. So uh, this was absolutely amazing. We got really, really lucky to get him this high here. So I'm very excited to show you guys exactly what he can do. I just actually got his uh, skill once maxed out as well. We're gonna try and get up the combined attack just to get that extra CC. But holy crap, the man is the big 60K with nearly 40K magic attack, 50% crit rate and 75% crit damage. Now I'm working on the crit rate and crit damage to an extent using at least the gear that we do have. We have an LR crit damage uh, earring here, an UR crit rate ring, and a defense um, LR piece as well, while utilizing attack speed and crit damage. Now, for the most part with this here, I am trying to aim to get some more crit rate or get some more crit damage as well, but we've re-rolled these guys to be as perfect as they can be, at least with three things that are mandatory. So I went with magic attack, magic attack regular, and, at and at least accuracy as kind of like my three staples. And then you have, of course, this one, magic attack, magic attack, crit damage, being three staples and then one off stat. Um, this one needs to be re-rolled because um, defense and damage resistance is not good. So I will be trying to use the higher reroll stones when those do come out to make it better. And then of course, as these three staples, damage rest is an off piece, uh, three staples actually here, the attack being the off piece. And then of course, HP being the off piece and defense being the off piece for this piece. Um, we've kind of optimized him to the best we can here, even with his talents that we do have, which we are setting him to crit damage and the damage dealt, as well as a crit damage stat here as well um while we do have a defense stone here and a actually hp stone i do want to get him a speed stone for this to make him a little bit better since he does get more damage off of having higher speed in general um yeah we're going to try and give him at least a shot and see what exactly what he can do now the team we're going to be using is this one as usual here my old faithful old reliable team here and we're going to be fighting some folks so let's go ahead and jump straight into it seeing what we can get into and i'm really excited now if you guys didn't know, I do have a Discord now set up for you guys. I will have the link in the description as well as in the comment section down below if you guys are interested on in jumping in here. Um, I'm happy that a lot of you guys actually ended up joining yesterday and it really made my day. I'm not even gonna lie. I expected not too many people to jump in, but a lot of you ended up checking it out and uh, enjoying your time there. So that does make me kind of happy. Now, I'm not happy that we just did not crit for nothing. Like, can we get a crit? Can we get a juicy one, please? There we go. Okay, now we're looking kind of nice. Um, But let's go ahead and get the defense up here, at least the shield immediately. And then I think this is pretty much GG's here. If we just go ahead and ult, bonk, and there we go. Immediately overweight here. And our Noel actually still needs to be built fully because we are missing a couple things on her. Now, with this team here or with this set, I am missing a little bit of things here. I could very well just give him a uh, Noelle's crit rate set. I think she has, or either I think she has a crit damage set. I'm not too sure, but um, yeah, she has a crit damage set, but we are trying to work on getting more crit rate because I'm not going to lie. I kind of need that crit rate for him because when he does crit, he hits like an absolute menace stinking truck. But if he does not crit, that's kind of where things can be a little bit iffy. So um, let's see what we can get into. I'm gonna fight this guy. Who knows, it might not be a good decision um, seeing it is a mirror match team here, but we're gonna see what we can do here. Now, last match, we didn't get too many crits. I am hoping this match we can get at least a better crit here because um, I ain't gonna lie, come on, that was kind of lackluster, man. Like, I wanna see something better. So let's see what we got here. Not gonna get that off, which is perfectly fine. I think I'm going to kill off the Julius once again because I don't really want him uh, getting that revive later on. And 176k, which I will easily take that, then go ahead and come back 
with the 133, which wasn't even a crit. So I will take that as well. Not even bad when it does come down to this. Um, when he doesn't crit, he still does a ton of damage. It's just not as high as what I was like it here. But I can't lie, that skill too does some high key damage dealing. And for some of you guys who don't know exactly what the card does, pretty much it boosts all attack. And it's actually one of the highest all attacks in the absolute game, if not the highest all attack in the absolute game here and just makes him just absolutely just disgusting to go against. So let's go ahead and smack him up here, immediately get that kill off and a goodbye. And that is once again, another win here. The only thing I think I need to really evaluate on this character is really that crit rate, because that crit rate kind of can determine if you win or lose, depending on who you're fighting. So um, I am very well trying to do something a little bit better. Now I would like to fight this to an extent, but there's a certain character here named Mimosa, my girl that I just, I don't like fighting Mimosas. I've learned that through the time of playing this game on JP, she's just never going away. She's always there. She's like a thorn in your side. So we will see how we do this one here. Go ahead and pop the ult here. And then um, I'm gonna try to kill off. Yeah, we're gonna just kill off Julius, get that double kill on him. Um, oh, whoa, that was a decent bit of damage. There we go. Um, get that actual follow up here and immediately just get ready for the retaliation because I already know um, he's going to try to retaliate on us a little bit here in which I don't think by attacking it's going to do us any good. So let's go ahead and barrier up because I feel like if we just killed him off, he's just going to get rezzed anyways. And it's not going to make us deal anything better. So it's better just to go ahead, kill off one of them, get the extra attack as well. Then he gets rezzed, or at least she gets rezzed. And we'll follow up with at least the uh, skill two. So I think that's probably the better choice. Because I swear, I do not like uh, Mimosa in any part when it comes to this team. So unfortunately, we don't have our skill two again. We didn't get the refresh, but we still have the ultimate here. Let's go ahead and get this nice hit here. And oh, that did so little damage right there. But um, let's go ahead and come back up here. And I think this is pretty much GG's. Um, as long as we go ahead and get rid of Miss Mimosa here, because look at that. She just keeps coming back. She won't go away. And that's the that's the problem with Mimosa. I don't I don't need you alive. I need you dead. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get rid of her. She's gone. Don't have to worry about her anymore. And from here, it's pretty much all she wrote. Now um so far, I hope you guys are enjoying the video. I hope you guys are enjoying to see exactly what Julius himself can do now. Um, I can't lie, he's definitely stupid strong now, a little bit too strong. And I feel like once we do get that crit rate that we're missing, he's gonna become the most disgusting thing I own currently. So that's something I'm looking forward to already. But um, I can't freaking wait. I can't wait. I'm hoping to hit at least like if I use the Fenrir and Balto's team, I could try to hit 500 plus because I know in our other video, we managed to actually hit 400K pretty much. I think it was like 370, 380. So we came around close to 400K, which was really, really nice. And um, I want to see if we can do something like that again. But let's go ahead and just do this because they don't have a revive. Skill two immediately doing... 172k like crazy cheese and then immediately following up with this here bonk and we're good we're good to go only one alive is mars which doesn't truly surprise me i'm being honest with myself so let's just quickly just get rid of this and i think that's a w i'm not gonna lie i'm very satisfied with this i'm very satisfied with this but of course I won't only end off the video with just showing a little bit of PvP. We got to show what he can do in PvE because, of course, um, PvE wise, he does do a little bit more damage as well. So I want to show you guys exactly what happens in PvE as well. The give everyone a good example of what he can actually do. So um, we're going to immediately do this. And then I think, yeah, I think we'll be fine. So go ahead and use this here. I'm going to use the skill. Oh, wait, no, this is a Julius team. So let's go ahead and kill off the Julius immediately. 130K. Oh, that is so lovely. Bonk. 200K immediately with the level two. Oh, dude, this is so broken. 
I'm I'm enjoying this too a little too much. I, as you guys can tell, I've enjoyed this a little too much. But then we go ahead and end it off with at least another new care. So very happy with what at least he can deal. I think <laughs> once we actually do everything we need to, it's gonna make this man so much scarier. But um, before we end out the video here, although this is a PvP video, I did suggest at least I did want to show you guys exactly what he could possibly do here. So um, let's go to the red dungeon or we can actually test this out a little bit more here and uh, give you guys a better look. Now, this is what he'll do with a um, person who takes down the defense as well and with William on the side here. So we're going to see exactly what will happen. I'm fairly, fairly interested for the most part. Um, I am going to try to play it a little safe here. So what we're going to do, I think... Boosting is going to be useless here, so let's use our ultimate here. Because if we boost and get past uh, Julius himself, it's not going to be too nice, but immediately an ADK crit here. Um, let's use this here as well. And then I think we're all good. Yep, incapacitation on everybody, so we'll have the absolute amazing amount of damage we can get here. And then now let's go ahead and let um, William come up here get the actual buff and then let's see exactly how much we do so let's go with the you know what i just want to see what the skill do the skill to do let's see what the skill two does here bonk 215 here in which we did not even crit two i've actually oh my god this man is just gonna be so great he's gonna be such an asset to this goddamn team that is just making me excited so let's see what we can do here with the at least actual ultimate 314 k looking nice here skill two at least skill one immediately getting a nice 84k without any buffs once again and it, it really just shows how strong this man really is now which is my way freaking hyped up thing here i'm not gonna lie it makes me a little bit too happy to see that he works so well at this point but um this is this is how he works now guys so i'm fairly at least interested to see exactly what happens and if you guys want at least tips and tricks like that for your at least your uh what's it called your account here of course be sure to join the discord we are doing count reviews here and i am doing a stream later on today so look forward to that as well if you guys are going to see this but um till then everybody i think this is all i really wanted to showcase for the most part go ahead and just kill that thing off with a 90k crit looking kind of nice looking dastardly actually but um let's go ahead and just hit with this yeah look oh my god <laughs> so much damage but i'll talk to you guys all next time here hope you guys enjoyed it if you did smash that like button for hey consider subscribing if you are new i do daily bcm content and can't wait to continue producing more peace out